Hello beautiful friends, so today I'm at the dungeon in my garage again, that's where I'm starting. But I'm also going to declutter a little bit of my bedroom. So I started by getting rid of this laundry hamper that we've had since my sons were little. And now they're young adults, so definitely they has to go. And then I have this sack of pizza board game. And we never really used it, it was fun, we did some of the questions, but since I picked it up at the thrift shop, we never really put like food in it. You're supposed to put like slices of pizza and it has all these different nice questions. But I'm not sure if I'm going to get rid of it or just keep it as a memento from now on. But this one I'm definitely getting rid of. So a lot of this stuff is just decor. I, I'm doing a lot of books and journals as well, but not on this video. So today is more on the decor and getting rid of the things that I already had packed away like this bag. You've already seen but now i'm finally gonna deliver it over to my friend miss rita whom i love like a mom she's my friend and that's who i donate all my things to and uh, she makes a lot of good use of it and i have this beautiful tray that i almost wanted to keep let me tell you though i did regret giving this little vessel away so i took it out and uh, i also took out the little reindeer napkin rings I wanted to keep those and these florals because they're brand new and they look so pretty when I was putting them away. So I feel guilty about taking those three pieces out of the boxes, but it is what it is. Sometimes that happens. Actually, I took out this little vessel too. So I did keep those four items, but everything else is going like those beads. And then this sign I was thinking about it. So I'm going to think about it a little bit more. And sometimes it's okay not to be ready to give things away. But I'm happy to say that I was able to get, of a, get rid of a whole car filled of things today. So that was really nice. So this one I ended up just keeping it. And then this is another little chair that I found that we had in one of the corners. This is a pretty cool little chair. I don't even know how to open it, but I don't think I've ever used it. I think I got it at a thrift shop. It's nice to sit in, but look, I may keep it. <laughs> Will it hold me is the question. Oh, apparently so. I think I'll keep it. Okay, this is a piece of glass that I don't know what it belongs to, so it's gonna go. Look at these, they're so pretty. I got them new from the thrift shop, but they originally came from Dollar Tree. Not Dollar Tree. They originally came from Target. Look, they were $2.99. I could sell these easily, but I'm just going to get rid of them. They're beautiful, though. But they are bulky. Realistically, I'm not selling anymore right now, so out they go. <laughs> Let's see, this is pretty cool, but and it's brand new. But to be honest, it has a cord and I don't want to deal with cords. It was $5.98 somewhere. I don't know where, but it's been Michael's maybe. I don't know. In either case, it's going to go. Goodbye, beautiful one. You're so cutesy cutesy. Oh, I'm going to this container, see if there's anything I could declutter or at least organize these things elsewhere so I can leave it free and clear on this this bin. This is a tough job in the heat. See, I put it to safety up there, so now it's safe and out of the bin. So I was very happy to get all those candlesticks out of this bin and now it is completely empty. However, I do have these here that I need to get rid of and the candlesticks have to find a different home. So I was able to do that and I was very happy. Oh, thank you, sweetheart. Look over here. Say hello, friends. Hello, friends. So here my hubby was nice enough to put all these things into the car for me and off we went to give these to Ms. Rita. Now these are napkins I was going to give away and I have to admit I left them in the car in case I need them. But anyway, so we're on our way and my my friend Ms. Rita's daughter lives close to me about 10 minutes. So that was really easy because Ms. Rita doesn't really live close to me. She lives a little bit farther away. But the fact that she comes with her daughter every week makes it easier for me because when I have stuff to give her, I go and give it to her at her daughter's house. Look, it, it's a car full of 
decor so I was happy to do that and even the pillows she was so, so happy to see that I brought her blankets and pillows and she really loved these they're so beautiful I love them but they had to go they're bulky and I'm not into that color right now anymore anyhow but look I decided to declutter the under the desk area of my hubby because those are my things under there I have to say it took me about an hour to do this and I was already exhausted it was late but I was glad to rearrange some of these things some of the things I got rid of but let's go through them so I had all these binders in a box and like this one here this is actually our wedding album part part of our honeymoon album actually and maybe one of these days I will share this with you but for today I wanted to see what was in here now this is like the final final arrangements you know at um, some point <laughs> we all have to go so I do keep one of those which is something to people don't like to talk about it but it's something that's needed to be had and so I have that there and then I have these other binders that really belong to my sons so I'm going to declutter these and then this is a home management binder I used to keep a lot of home management binders but now I only have it condensed to one but I think I'm going to condense it even more further and look this is just my work related binder and also when I was a student that was funny to see I had like a memento here like you know reminiscing over a lot of these certificates that I got you know phlebotomy technician at one point customer service excellence and you know it was nice to see all these things that I worked hard for and then I kept one of my applause cards one of many and these were nice cards to get and look even my nursing schedule calendar is there the old school I don't know what they use nowadays if you didn't know I am a nurse registered nurse and I worked for many hospitals in the ER but look I also worked in the mental health department and look this little this little girl made me this beautiful card and drawing and I was so thankful to see that again you know she was amazing and I just I, I wish her well and I hope that she's blessed enough to gain her mental health but anyway I'm continuing here and I only left these mirrors there because I don't know where I'm going to put them yet but here we're going to continue with this the toilet paper is there because I have allergies and sometimes the Kleenex are just not enough but anyway I have this beautiful journal and some greenies that belong to my puppies my doggies well they're not puppies they're doggies now but they're seniors now but it is what it is so I'm going to give the, give those to them and then these are my stickers that I started kind of organizing somewhat last time but I wasn't able to finish and I also did not finish today but at least I got to see what was in here and these are all my washi tapes that I have here in this little zipper pouch and then this other little binder is my son's work related things and then this box had this little thing that says one day at a time this little planner kind of thing and I really like that because I'm really feeling exhausted so I'm going to quit it call it quits soon but I wanted to share how I decluttered all those binders out of here I left one of them in there the pocket file accordion file thing and then these things are going to go to the trash and the papers and then these books I don't even know what I'm going to do with them because they're nice little books I got them at Dollar Tree I believe and I think I meant for them to be like a kind of a dietary like a meal man a meal planning sort of planner if you will so I may end up using them for that but look they do say beautiful things on scripture and little things to reflect on so I that's the reason why I really love them but I don't know how consistent I'm going to be with them so if I'm not consistent with at least one then I'm going to get rid of the others but I think these are really nice they're all the same so I really like those and time to pick up the last little bits of that and that was really good to really just declutter a little bit and my doggies had the last little bit of the greenies so I could throw away that bag and now they're happy and content and I'm happy too because I got to declutter although I still have this box in my living room this is going to push me to actually take care of this instead of staring at it in my bedroom all the time and that's one of the things that has really worked for me just bring it into your space until it bugs you enough to get rid of it or to organize it or bless others with the things it truly is the best feeling when you give something nice to others and they have truly enjoyed and appreciated 
I want to thank you guys so much for watching. Remember to live well, healthy, happy, and organized. Many blessings and stay tuned for the next video. Thanks for watching, friends.